Local leaders say they are concerned African Americans are often hit hardest by COVID-19. They just wrapped up a virtual town hall discussing the impact on minorities. News 6's Jerry Askin tuned in. He joins us now with more on their message. And the whole point of today's virtual town hall was to make people aware of how black people are being impacted by COVID-19. Many who already have pre-existing health conditions and lack of access to quality health care and testing. A lot of uh, stress during these times, so we want to encourage individuals to stay informed. Right now, as Orlando City Commissioner Bakari Burns is happy to hear of more COVID-19 testing coming to the west side of Orange County, where many African Americans live, he also wants blacks to be aware of how the virus can affect people of color and may perhaps even lead to a deadly situation. What we are seeing is that uh, access to care, individuals start to seek care at a, uh, at a later stage. So oftentimes more resources are needed to uh, bring their health uh, back up to optimal health. Today he joined City Commissioner Regina Hill, doctors and therapists for a virtual town hall to address the COVID-19 health disparities among black people. Minorities tend to have lower incomes and those who are at the lower end of the financial spectrum tend to struggle to stay uh, healthy. The latest stats here in Orange County show African Americans make up about 12 percent of cases. But Commissioner Burns said nationwide blacks contracting and even dying from COVID-19 is becoming way more common. He's stressing now more than ever self-care and even therapy. In general, um, African Americans, I believe, don't seek mental health counseling or mental health care uh, like we should. In Orlando, Jerry Askin, Getting Results, News 6.